I'm uh, Dr. Bill Ray uh, from the Environmental Health Center of Dallas. I founded uh, this clinic uh, some 35 years ago uh, for the, uh, to find the aspects or define the aspects of cardiovascular disease and other uh, diseases that were environmentally induced. Uh, I've written uh, uh, eight textbooks and uh, I've written numerous uh, papers, 150 scientific papers. Uh, I'm speaking on the fluoride issue and I feel that uh, Dallas should not put any more fluoride in the water. We have numerous patients uh, so somewhere in the thousands who can't drink Dallas water. One of the reasons is because of the fluoride that's in it. Uh, several thousand patients who can't tolerate uh, fluoride uh, in their uh, water and we have tested them and proved uh, cause and effect from this. Uh, I think that uh, we uh, have enough fluoride in Dallas water and I don't think we should add any more because it is a toxic substance. It's a brother of chlorine and uh, we know that chlorine is necessary for the city of water but we don't want to add more poison to this because it can affect similar systems in the body. Uh, we know that there is natural fluoride in Dallas water and that should be enough uh, to do whatever people are looking for, but we certainly don't need any more uh, fluoride in the water, in my opinion.